Good morning, guys. It is finally fall. It's really cold. I'm wearing a sweater and shorts. How weird am I? Whatever. Okay, so I usually keep the sheep in this little shed by the house at night so they don't get too cold, predators don't get them, whatever else. And then in the mornings, I come out here and get them and feed them a bottle. So I'm gonna show you what that looks like. And I have a whole lot of helpers with me. Oh, and where's your shirt, dude? You not um, cold? No, I was hot, so I took it off. Oh, okay. All right, let's open this door and let these sheepies out and feed them. Oh, oh look at that. Okay, this is Willow weaning. She is four weeks old now. I can't believe she's that old. Already. <laughs> yeah, that's Aspen. This is the youngest. She's only a week old, but she's as big as Willow. The dog wants the milk. The dog wants the milk. The dog wants the milk. All right, here you go, Willow. singing. Don't worry. All right, after I get done giving them their bottles, I take them down and I put them in pen one so that they can graze all day long. Come on, Aspen. She's trying to drink milk from the dog. That dog does not have milk for you. Come on, Aspen. Okay, Carolina, come on. Let's go feed the rest of the animals. Yeah. What's that big old belly doing? You got to bust out some babies? Hopefully. I'm surprised you didn't have them last night because it was so cold. Ooh, Bluella. And Sweet Belle. Okay, so I need to feed water and refresh their litter. It's getting kind of gross in there. Okay, a nice clean cage. Water, food. New bedding, happy birdies. Now it's time to feed the kitty cats. Buffet style. Okay. Now I'm gonna take this bucket, fill it up with bird feed, and go feed all the birds. Billy's up there getting corn for the pig. 
was finally able to catch this rooster and clip his wings and put him in here with the pig and all these hens. I know he's not the same breed, but he is gonna have to do for now. All right, Lily got the corn for the pig. The pig really likes the chicken feed, so whatever. I tried to lure the chickens into this pen, but it didn't work. The lambs are sitting out here in the shade. But of course, when I come, they have to run up to me. Silly blammies. That fur was from Romeo. Mm-hmm. Also, I have built coops and coops and coops. And they choose to lay their eggs in this nasty spot of the hitch of this dumpy trailer. Crazy bird. Peppers are still doing really good. And look at those zucchini. Amazing, they're doing great here. I can't wait to get some fruit from those. I don't see any starting yet, but there are some flowers. All right, well, the kids take care of the rabbits, so I don't really have to film that part because I don't have to worry about it. But I'm gonna show you the rabbits. I came upon a dust bath. Look at that. All right, so this is Duchess. I call her that because she's Dutch colored and she's really pretty. She's probably about to be a mama soon. As long as... Here's our Californian rabbit. She is very upset right now, which makes me think she's probably pregnant as well. Yes, yeah, this is Bubbles. This is a lion head mix. This is Lotso, and she might be being a mama. I'm not sure she is pregnant or not. I tried and I wasn't able to stay and watch the breeding, so we'll see what happens. Isn't she so cute though? Look at that little face. Oh yeah. This is our buck. He is Rex Rabbit. His name is Fluff and Stuff. Because he's so fluffy. Look at that little face. Mwah. I love rabbits. Rabbits are my favorite. Oh, he's not pregnant. I'm um, the chicken master. <laughs>
And this is how I feed the dogs. They have unlimited food all the time. When it gets low, I just put another 50 pound bag of feed in there and they're happy to have food all the time. If they don't get food all the time, they either run away or they just fight all the time. So you like having your food all the time, don't you? Yes, she does. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me today for my morning chores. It's getting hot out here now, so I'm gonna go inside and start packing. We are getting ready to go to Michigan. Um, I don't know if you saw the news, but my grandpa died, and so we are going to be burying him on Tuesday. And we're heading up there on Monday morning, and we'll be there till Wednesday. So, hope you guys have a good day. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.